America is not a racist country. Ladies and gentlemen, Jason Van Dyke, the murderer of Laquan McDonald is due to be released on February 3rd. Seem like he just got there, don't it? Boy, what a, a little chintzy little sentence they gave him. Definitely don't match the crime. So he got an 81 month sentence, but he only had to serve 39 months. And this is for pumping 16 bullets into a black teen, y'all. I know many of you, especially if you're from Chicago, you remember this case. After serving a little more than 39 months of an 81 month sentence for shooting a black teen in 2014, former Chicago police officer, Jason Van Dyke, will be released from prison next month. Van Dyke released is set for February 3rd. Van Dyke was sentenced in 2018 after being found guilty of second degree murder and 16 counts of aggravated battery in the October 2014 shooting death of 17 year old Laquan McDonald. Van Dyke was eligible to take time off his prison term with credit for good behavior because he was convicted of second degree murder, the Sun Times reported. McDonald's shooting was captured on video, which was released about a year after the killing, and he was clearly walking away from Van Dyke when he pumped those 16 bullets into him. The dash cam video showed McDonald walking away from Van Dyke just before the officer, who is white, um, shot 16 times at McDonald. So he was still a child, underage. The shooting and the eventual release of the video led to protest in the streets of Chicago and a reckoning for the city's police department. The Justice Department issued a report in 2017 that called for a comprehensive reform, which does no good for the Black community, of a department it accused of excessive force and civil rights violations. Well, first of all, your reforms never change anything. I've been hearing reforms my entire life, and I have yet to see any changes made in the police department. They shoot now (laughs) as much as ever. And y'all don't change any policies when you put reforms together. It's reforms on uh, on paper only. As far as the way these folks police, you don't change a thing about that. Those reforms are a joke that y'all come up with. And you know what? You want those reforms to be ineffective. You know, it don't take this long to make policies work if you really want to. Y'all really don't want to. That's why we see little to no change. I have never seen no major change. But Van Dyke getting out 39 months later after pumping 16 bullets in a young black teen. I tell you what, if that... 17 year old, if Laquan McDonald pumped 16 bullets in Jason Van Dyke, he would never see the light of day again. This lopsided, one sided criminal justice system that y'all got is for the damn birds. This is a joke that he's getting out in that amount of time. This is a big joke. He needs the McMichael treatment. That's what he needs. An early release, no, because I see Jason Van Dyke as a threat to the community. That's all he is. And good. And one thing I am glad we don't see his old crying and weeping wife anymore. Boy, she can give you a headache. But y'all, please tell me what you think about this story. I think this is a travesty that this man is even getting out of jail for what he did. 
please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video.